Hello and welcome to Jenny's Fashions and Styles. Hello everybody, thank you for being here again every week, every Tuesday at 10 in the morning here in Orlando. And thank you and welcome to the new viewers. Today we're gonna continue talking about my trip in Chicago, but we're gonna have a little more of my outfits. I mean, I'm gonna have all the outfits I wear over there until the end of the trip. And I have, I am saving something special for the next week because also I went to a store that I wish you can see. I mean, it is awesome, great. I was so excited to be there. So that's gonna be next Tuesday. But today we're gonna, I'm gonna continue showing you some parts that we went with my family. And also this, the outfits I wear and how I mix it and why I mix it that way. You know, Chicago, it's beautiful, but also it's a lot of walking, like my Lima that I miss. But in the same time, uh, you don't want to be just, you know, no fashionable. <laughs> you want to be fashionable and you want to enjoy and you want to have nice pictures with your family or by yourself if you want to go by yourself. And if you go by yourself, of course, you can have options to go to clubs and to more fancy places. Well, I have my family and sometimes my kids were not so happy to go somewhere, some places. They're like, oh, I don't want to go there, mommy. So, as a mom, uh, you sacrifice a lot of stuff. But if you go by yourself, maybe you don't. Maybe later on I will be able to go to different places with my kids. But you know, now they are eight years old. And also my Megan got a little sick the last, uh, the last, come on, almost the last day. I took the day before we we came here to Orlando and you will see and I will tell you where it was the spot that she got sick and also I gotta stay at the hotel for the whole day so my husband went, went out with uh, my son but it was so sweet to see how they miss each other they are twins you know anyway coming back to fashion let's go watch the video see a little bit of my fashion and also see about a little bit of what I did over there and I promise you next week is gonna be more 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 fashion stuff and no no my life showing <laughs> showing you but I thought and also I have people that were writing me and say I would like to know about you do you have family are you single are you married are you have a child you don't so yes I am married I have kids and I guess I told you the first, first, first video I made, October the 10th. And there's gonna be one year of my YouTube channel. I am so excited about it. And thank you for being there, the ones that were from the beginning. And thank you for the new ones that are just seeing who is this, who is this girl and what is she talking about. We talk about fashion, but in this video, we're gonna talk about fashion slash family, family trip kind of like that okay so let's go watch the video and don't forget I'm sorry all the time me forgetting stuff you know sometimes when you're 50 you forget don't forget to subscribe down here and put your thumbs up if you like it and leave your comments about do you been in Chicago before or oh, which place do you like to go if you've been there which other place you would recommend it for go with the kids or if you are single which place is nice to go by yourself <laughs> you know all that stuff and if you wear tennis shoes also when you go to Chicago or not anyway so let's go watch the video my outfits in Chicago that day was a 4 of July, light so I pick this blue blouse you know with um, a shorts believe me I have shorts there <laughs> with my tennis shoes of course I know I have to be walking long for a long time and I just pick it like a loose I say well I can wear loose I can put this clip these clips are magic for me I like it I was long time ago in fashion and now I just use it like that and it makes the blouse a little a little more tight on my body or also I, I do the option of putting my blouse inside but my husband told me Jenny you're the only one we are have blue and red we need a white a white color because it's for a few lights so get me here I just changed the top I wear my white blouse and we are in red blue and white he got kind of 
royal blue but anyway so here we are going out again walking was a little a little um hot that day not as much as here florida but we enjoy so much walk through the beautiful river the views are awesome wherever you go whatever you uh, walk and see is uh, it has a, a beauty no the beauty of buildings and also nature there is a nice restaurant over there people were sitting walking eating or drinking a coffee and look these buildings my kids were amazing <laughs> with those architectural designs they were fantastic we are enjoying And here we are after walking around we, we arrived to a park of course they were telling me mommy i'm so tired tired i want to eat some ice cream and luckily it was an ice cream guy right there and guess what yes they got an ice cream of course i can't because uh, i don't have good tolerance to the lactose but they do so they enjoy and after that they refresh a little bit and cool off we we'll continue walking around this beautiful park. That area it was an area where they have big concerts and you know outside concerts, really beautiful, nice to see. And my daughter was in all blue. She, you know she wants to be in that color. And after that we arrived to the uh, the bean. You see me in the bean. There you go. Hi. There we are. My kids are a little silly. Saying hi. <laughs> and with a lot of people there it was a nice place what I like more was the under part where the, you know, that that part you will see why I was gonna get you dizzy there <laughs> because I love to like a turn around you will see there is the picture and there is how I, I'm gonna make you dizzy get ready mm -hmm. And I was getting dizzy also when I was doing it. <laughs> it was so cool. That part is really cool. We love it. We are excited. The kids were having fun. Just looking, you know, the continuing of that view. After that, we will continue walking because that's what you do. Walk, walk, walk over there. And there they are being silly, a little silly. That's my daughter. <laughs> And after they was having fun and they were enjoying being there, we continue walking. Okay, sit down. Well, my daughter wants to take a picture. She she loves to post for pictures, so she asked me, and there is one of the pictures of her. And after my son said, "What about me?" So we sit down and we walk, and we took a picture. After that, we were walking, and. At exactly at the front of that park where the bean was and we found this uh, Italian place and we also we ate pasta and pizza stuff like that that is really popular over over uh, Chicago my kids were enjoying their drawings they're having fun there continue walking you see tennis shoes all the time continue walking and walking and we arrive to this other place that it was it, everything is like a really kind of close by and they were celebrating like a, the a taste of Taiwan it was interesting and nice music and it was a festivity everywhere you were walking um, because it was the 4th of July and you can see here the architecture is was really really beautiful really interesting yeah i like that they have you know gra i mean flower the flower stuff different every single part it's like a, every single place have to be in charge of their front yard kind of like that i like that after that we went to the hotel and the next day the next day i made the decision to wear this this um jeans like a leopard 
mixing with different colors uh, jeans with the white blouse and of course the tennis shoes now we're going out there is my outfit also I'll, all the time i bring like a little um, uh, blouse to put on top because it gets a little chilly in the morning morning if you see the wind it's kind of windy over there and we went to that area where we have a wind there's a beautiful beautiful winds and your winds there you go there's me posing of course all the family wants to pose for you there's my daughter trying to pose and smile that's my megan the brother the cool brother tyler and my lovely husband emory here we are all the family sitting we're just behind the beautiful heart transients and you will see us there there we are the whole family and i don't do my hair that day as you see it's all curly because that's my natural hair that's the next day now and we went to this tallest the tallest let's listen to my husband 23rd tallest building in the world there you go we're going to the sky deck up there at the building of course tennis shoes i wore the same jeans they had the day before but in this case i combined it with black with a black top we brought our mm, kind of see jackets something simple to to wear as in case the ac you know sometimes the ac is really strong in those places and so we brought it and uh, it was really interested we saw a lot of pictures you know to the way to go up there it was a lot of uh, pictures about chicago places yeah, that we've we been that yesterday. and we saw the streets and really cute and really well made and entertaining it My kids were so excited to see some buildings that they already saw before. So they were like learning their names because every single building has a name here. The architecture is really, really fun. That's the building that we were in. You see, it's the highest. It's the highest there. That's that's the building. And that's before to. <laughs> to get my silly kids before to get into the part word that's a concert area you know all the stuff that they do in chicago all the entertainment you know the second city okay tyler that is like a comedian like a comic area and here we are getting into the uh the um elevator yeah we're here so are we going up there? Yeah. Welcome to the Sky Deck. Look, look at that You're on your number. way to the top of the tallest building in the Western Hemisphere. I feel your ears. Along the way, you can watch as we pass by some of the tallest buildings, monuments, and structures in the world. Oh my. You're riding up this 1,450-foot modern marble in one of the tower's 104 elevator cars. Your trip to the Sky Deck will only take about a minute. That means your elevator is traveling at a speed of more than 24 feet per second. The tower opened its doors in 1973 and held the title of the world's tallest building for 25 years. The west antenna reaches 1,730 feet above the Chicago streets. Yeah, there's the ears. <laughs> We're now passing 850 feet in San Francisco's Transamerica Pyramid, 970 feet in the Yokohama Landmark Tower, Japan's tallest building. 1,062 feet in Paris's stunning Eiffel Tower. Oh my gosh. The Bank of China Tower in Hong Kong. 1,250 feet in the Empire State <laughs> Building in New York. And now we're here, 103 stories up. Oh Welcome nice. to the top. Now we are out. 
and we start posting for you there's a little um, windows over there but after we continue walking walking and we discover more more windows and after you know people were taking pictures some nice people were offering to take picture of us that's the view that that you have from there but uh, also you can go to this other area where they have like a the glass uh, window that you can get on top of it and we'll show you later but the beautiful was a beautiful view my husband was telling me well, you know the hotel is over here over here and I was like okay I don't know no hi us. look at the cars this is the part where I think my daughter got some okay. bacteria virus whatever because it was really um, she played over there and after we have to do immediately the line to go through the to the windows that was telling you. Hi. Hi. It's really fun and we're having a nice day and we're almost done in line. <laughs> so those are the windows that were telling you. So I, I think and I was looking for my spray, my hand sanitizer spray and I was empty. I used it so much. So there we are. Look at that. Stand up, stand up, stand up, Good job. Okay, now daddy. My sweet husband. This is my cutie. And me. Sitting there, posing. And enjoying and admiring the beautiful view. There are my kids again. And after the classic pictures and seeing and checking all the stuff that they have around there, that was the, the end of the day. Next day, I make decision to wear this beautiful white dress i put a blouse on top of it a gym blouse on top of it because i thought you know it was a um, short sleeve i mean no sleeve there you go and when we went down the stairs for the breakfast i was it was really chilly so i went up and grabbed my jacket i mean grabbed my blouse and put it on top and i was okay Tennis shoes again. Usually, if you see me, if you follow me on my Instagram, you see that I love to wear high heels all the time. But, well, this time I have to wear tennis shoes because I was in Chicago. And also I have to walk to meet my friend that I was with her in school, high school. Really good. So it was so sweet to see her sharing with my kids the origami that she does. And she was, you know, guiding, guiding and teaching them how to do that. That's my friend Pilar so beautiful so sweet girl next day i wore this blouse this is one of my favorite tops i have this orange blouse but the inside is like a hard fuchsia um with my jeans and of course the tennis shoes again sorry i had just brought one tennis shoes i don't i cannot bring too much too much stuff because my luggage was full because I have to bring my kids' stuff and their doubles and plus my husband's stuff. It was too much to bring. But anyway, I wear this with the blouse. I put it outside, put it inside. So showing you maybe two options to wear it. Do you know that with a, with a blouse, I'm sorry, this top with sun um, skirt will be also beautiful. It's, um, I feel like it's really uh, happy color and lovely color to wear now at the, at the summertime. So continue. We are everyday walking. Yes, you do a everyday walking like I was doing back in Lima all the time. Here in Orlando, I just drive all over. But there you have to walk. That's a point to take a pictures. People love to take pictures there. But we walk and we went to see something different. Let me show you. Hockey player thing is actually the Indian thing. Hi. <laughs> yeah, this is 
buildings over buildings until we yeah, arrive the weather is much better. to the place I want to show you. It's not that place. <laughs> I love that you know you are able to eat outside. Here is a little too hot to eat outside in summer. Probably in spring or winter time is awesome to eat outside here in Orlando. But there is was really good to eat outside. There was has a good breeze and air and wind around there was just looking around <coughs> we arrived to this place this place called nutella you know the nutella well they have a restaurant about it of course there you go nutella cafe my kids of course asked for it so we went in there and we eat something in there we're sitting outside loving and seeing these beautiful buildings and, and flowers also and there's our table. There's my daughter. <laughs> and after we eat, eat there, we will just walk around. We went to this other park. You will see. There you go. There's our park with this fountain. That we took some pictures over there. Yeah. Well, we continue walking and we arrive to this uh, cute place that they have the fountain with um, like a video in the back. It was really cute. I love the flowers. I was so in love with this these paths that they put around. Every single area has this kind of uh, you know nature even this is a city so you know you know it's all concrete i love the mixing between the concrete and the green that that gives them so important you see that fountain it, it changed um the images that they that they have in the front i don't know if you can see in this video but uh, at night time i was I was seeing. Oh, there you go. You can see there a little bit. You see the faces, they come in and out, and the kids playing around, jumping, and splashing. Uh, it was it was not too hot, like I say, but when the kids run and walk all this way, yes, it was. It feels like a, you want to get a splash. We walk. That's my daughter. She was feeling a little not too good that day. And she told me, Mommy, I don't feel so good. So we came back home after that. Because I, f I felt her like she wasn't just as energetic as she usually is. And on our way home, we, were, we stopped in this area where they have uh, this greenhouse outside. It's, in the, no, it's really cute stuff that they have in the park you can see it we got inside the greenhouse there we are they were sitting in this big table look at that and it's all like a you're out but you're in <laughs> all in glass it looks good i like it i feel my kids were having yeah, fun in there. And after where did you go out? You never get to come We just went back to home. around and there is our hotel arriving to our hotel there you go the embassy suites and the next day that's what I wear the next day it was my um, cargo pants 
and that top and the blouse and of course the tennis shoes I guess we went just back downstairs to eat breakfast because my daughter wasn't feeling good so that was the day before we were coming back to home so I hope you enjoy thank you so much for watching I hope um, next time next Tuesday we will find and we'll see each other with more fashions and styles and it's gonna be about a store I went and I got in love with every single thing you need to see it you need to see it see you Tuesday bye bye Mwah. thank you